explorer and I venture into uh, places that are hard to reach to learn more about the planet. And on my last mission, which was inside of an active volcano, we were uh, trying to just see where we were going without falling in, obviously. We were descending to the bottom of a, a volcanic crater with a large lava lake. And we realized that uh, traditional thermal imaging doesn't work the same way that we really needed it to, to be able to map the terrain through which we were traveling. We developed uh, a, a computer vision technology that allows us to see where we're going in real time uh, and leverages augmented reality to present that information to the user as we're kind of moving through a space. The problem that I was trying to solve was actually one that was experienced by firefighters around the world on a very regular basis. C-Through is an amazing piece of technology because we managed to bring together three different pieces of technology, augmented reality optics, uh, cutting edge thermal cameras, as well as embedded computing in the form of new GPU computing units that are, are, have been released recently, to deliver something that really hasn't been possible before. And specifically, it allows firefighters to get in and out of fires faster than they've ever been able to before. The ability to see in these types of environments that, that we work in um, is, is a game changer in our industry. It, it, it could mean the difference between life and death. In the, in the highly stressful, cluttered environments that you confront in a fire situation, uh, the edge segmentation that we use, the edge detection that we use, allows the firefighter to rapidly get that shape and contour information that can rapidly aid in navigation. By having that information where you want it, right in front of your eye, when you want it, super high fast, and just like what you need, just the lines, you can navigate and execute efficiently within the scene uh, in a way that hopefully just gets out of the way of the firefighters and lets them do their jobs even better. Thermal imaging is incredible. It allows you to see through the dark. It allows you to see through a lot of particulate that impedes the progress of firefighters in the field. But there are two major problems that I saw with the current uh, solutions in the market. The technology a lot of times has a memory component to it that we know goes away in highly stressful environments. Specifically, a firefighter has to hold up a device, look through it, remember what they saw, and move. It's a stop, look, go model. That is a terrible thing to have in high stress environments where people's heart rates are elevated, where there's a element of, an element of anxiety going on. So we want to eliminate that memory deficit. Augmented reality optics does that. It delivers the image right to the user when they want it. The parallel is in the daylight. We don't have to think about what we're seeing. We're just seeing. With typical state-of-the-art thermal imagers, we have to work on what, we have to think about what we're seeing while we're thinking about something else. The edge detection, we just see it. It's just almost plain as day. Um, the quicker we can get in and out of a building, um, we're all safer. Our system allows a firefighter to take a better sense of their situational awareness so that they can make decisions much faster by having information directly in front of them rather than looking down with a certain amount of lag. The goal is to get firefighters in and out of the fire five times faster. The human eyes are limited in, in what they can do, so we're hoping to rely on technology in the future to help us see where we need to go, where the problems are, where the people are located. Um, it will just simply make us more effective, more efficient. We have big problems now, and those problems are going to continue to persist, and if we could actually multiply our efforts through the use of democratized technologies, which I think is absolutely possible, uh, I think we'll be able to solve problems a lot faster.